missing survivor. I cannot follow. Others need me, and your path leads beyond my reach. But I can grant you a fragment of myself as a guide to find what is most important to your ultimate survival. So, welcome back guys, and we have landed on space in Ark Survival Evolved. We are going to be going adventuring around space, seeing what there is, and if you guys want to adventure through space as well, you can download the map if you have Ark on Steam in the link in the description down below. It is very early access, but I thought it would be cool for a video to show you how awesome this map is going to be. Now, as I said, there are a lot of stuff missing with this because it's early access, but we're going to go adventuring, and I really believe this could have such good potential. Now, as always, if you guys do enjoy today's video, Video. look at the gravity it's so different um, then make sure to smash that like button let's go for over 600 likes for today's video and be subscribed if you want to see more videos like this where we try and do different you know adventures in arc so let's get straight in with things so you're probably wondering why we are breathing or why we don't have any armor and that's because we mostly go on our adventures Base, just as a normal survivor, we don't use any armor, we just go for it, and we have our friendly UFO with us today. So, and you're wondering what this is, this is a massive space station within Ark Survival Evolved, and, and things like this just shoot you into the air, there's like loads of like, look at this, wait, ready, let's see if we can go onto it again, ready? Now that is, I think you can run along to them, or maybe that's what shoots you up onto the podium, like platform thing, let's see. Yeah, there we go, so... And if I'm wrong, if we look around, you can see a lot's like alert, alert with like dinosaurs on it. And this thing actually shoots you up. Now, I think it stops you, though. I, don't, I feel like they're, they, they're planning on making this shoot you out into space, but it stops you right at the top. Um, but I think also you can check out loads of awesome little things around here. I do have, um, uh, obviously, like God Mode on and stuff, so we won't take any falling damage, but... The cool thing about this is you're probably thinking, we're in space, is that all we can see? There is lots of different types of places to discover. Now, I will come back to it, but what I want to show you first is the outside of space. So, if we shoot ourselves over to one of these little spaces, it looks like they're like bedrooms. And I think, do I have career, uh, uh, no, creative mode, sorry, yeah. So, I have creative mode enabled. So, I'll, I'll bring, let's just pretend the gravity is like not even existent. And we're going to come over here. And we will sh I'll show you a little bit about how this is going to work. These are the different arcs inside of space. Now, I thought it would be cool to show you the little, you know, UFO as well, like links in with it going to space. And there's different types of biomes around here in the world of space. Now, if you fall down there, the gravity does sort of, you know, balance you a bit. But you will end up just probably dying or something or just falling and falling and falling into nothing. And that is not what the plan is. The plan is today to see what we see the different types of places oh what a land and there we go so the first one we've got to remember is called ojo no mori and we're going to teleport there and you guys will see how awesome that mechanic is so we have landed on ojo no mori um we don't want to make we don't wanna, i don't know how many of these little space stations are around so we're gonna i feel like i want a ufo to to go around here so we're gonna spawn in we're gonna spawn in a ufo and the reason why we're gonna spawn in hopefully we can have it on this land is because can we use it oh i don't think we can use a ufo yet on this land oh no we can there we go okay and the reason why i want one is because you can get around very quickly and we are in space so we can have a little look around what is on this island so so far what it looks like is the, you know, this is pretty much, it is, as I said, it's early access. There is something in the middle. We're going to go have a look what that thing is in the middle after we explore this this island and see what's on it. And, and I feel like this could be a cool sort of like team wars, team battle sort of thing. What is this here? I don't even know what that is. But um, yeah, I, I feel like this has got so much potential. Exploring space. And um, it would be cool if you could see Earth somewhere. So it looks like you've like, flown from it, like I said at the start of the video. Um, but yeah, this is the first place. And we'll, uh, we'll we'll land the UFO. We'll leave. We'll have to keep spawning in different UFOs to fly around. It's not like it's massive. But we'll, also, we'll head back. And I'll show you again. The teleporting is really awesome. Get into it. And... You are you lost smart gravity and now you have gravity as you come back in here. So the first one we went into was that one. So we're going to move on now to T and Zeta, which will be interesting. So let's go to that land. Now bear in mind, um, some of them take a. Whoa! Where are we? Okay. 
This one is interesting. Is this water? It's got to be water. Um, I'm not sure the water's fully finished yet because we just fell through it. Um, but yeah, this is this this is an interesting one. What can I spawn? I might spawn in a UFO so um, we can fly around it a little bit and see. I feel like it's just going to be basic like this at the moment. So I suppose we could just oh, there's more there's more up there. Is that the thing in the middle that we're going to check out, or is that something actually on this island? I feel like. Oh no, they're just like the outskirts of it. Okay, I see. So I feel like this one could be quite a cool one when that gets developed. But, you know, I'm glad we had creative mode on so we didn't end up like falling down and dying straight away. And there's also a planet over there somewhere. I'd love to just adventure the worlds in Arc Survival Evolved. So that was that one. An interesting one. Still got a lot of work to do. But we're now moving on. So we'll see what is this the one we just. I think. I think this is the one we just went to. Yeah, so, so we'll go around like this. So the next one is. I think there's four in total is there oh there might be five i think there's five so where is this lush okay we'll go we'll, we'll, we'll visit, visit the planet lush let's see what this one's gonna look like okay wow this has a little bit more detail is that a cave no we cannot be going exploring into a cave with with nothing to fight i mean i don't even know if there's any if there's anything on here to fight yet but wow this one is this one is cool i really like this this run down into this, this keep or maybe it just takes you oh it does take you to an underground bit oh that looks very interesting okay so this map actually has like an under um <laughs> um um that kind of freaked me out a little bit <laughs> is there more oh what <laughs> i'm going one sec let me get a ufo can i there we go all right let's hop into the ufo and we're gonna head down here what is going on here wait let's just hop out and leave that there's a n can we break anything we can't this is a strange one this is these must be the aliens of this planet that just feel like they're just all of a sudden going to turn their head on me and just like attack me. But I think we should probably leave. Um, I don't want to get, I don't want to be in someone else's territory. There's more down there. Oh, wow. Okay. What is this down here as well? I don't want to get lost. <laughs> I really don't want to get lost. What is this? Like a slide. Are we going to find our way back out of this? Oh, no. It keeps going for... Oh. Okay. I'm sure that wasn't planned, but how do we find our way back? Can we use a UFO to to leave, or can we? I suppose if we fly up really high, I could find the uh, the spawn in zone. But that that was a really cool one. It kind of spooked me out at the same time. Um, I thought we were going further and further down into like the depths. Oh, there we go. There's the spawn. So definitely out of all of them so far, that was my favourite one. Bit strange, but um, we'll we'll go with it. That was a very 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 fun. Um, so we'll drop down here. I think we've got two more to explore in space in Ark Survival Evolved. Did you think you'd ever see this? And uh, we'll teleport. There we go. Let's get back. And we need to look for... That's the one we just visited. So we need these two here. We've got... Okay. Let's go to this one. This one has a cool name, I think. Um, this. Some of them might take a bit... Okay, right. I thought that was a megalodon for a second. I don't think there's actually any. Oh wait, what's is that? A, there's a dolphin down there. Um, is this like an underground bit more of an underground? Um, oh no, oh no, we're not stuck because you can use crit. Oh, okay. This is really interesting. I suppose that's where it's crash. Some it's crash landed. Should we have a look at what's over here? This looks like a nice area, but is that a, is I think all like the like the uh, dinos and stuff like frozen in this game. Yeah, you just walk straight through them. You can't. They're not even like. Okay, interesting. Is and the water. Oh no, the water. You can swim in this water in this one, but for something something just tells me I don't want to be in in this water for some reason. It just doesn't give me the good vibes. But I like this one. Obviously, there's a lot of work to be put into these, but. Really like this. This this map is awesome. And now we've got one more left to explore. 
One more left. As I said, oh no, no, we've got one more left to explore. Then we're going to explore what that thing is in the middle there. Seeing if that's anything different. And see if you can actually leave these once you teleport into them. That would be an interesting thing. So, teleport. Final one. Is it over? Is this? No, so we've been to that one. It's this one here. Okay, so this is the final one to explore. Let's go. It has another, another cool name, I think. Oh, this is the ice one. Okay, so this is the frozen land. Are we gonna? Yep, all good to. Oh, it's a very, very, very cold one. What's gonna happen? Okay, so doesn't look like this is interactive yet. Are we? Yeah, we're all good. So I think this is probably again a bit of an unfinished one, maybe, but again has potential. I like the look of it and everything like that. But what we're gonna do now? I'm gonna. Where's the main base? That's what I want to know. Is 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 that the main base in the middle there? I think. Oh, that is the main base. I was. You guys have probably been like when you're watching, telling me that's the main base on the whole time. But let's see if we can fly over from one of them in a UFO to this. So let's spawn in one. I don't know why I keep spawning them in when I can just press one. I think. But um, yeah, let's go. You have lost smart gravity. Can I fly? Oh, I can. I can leave the islands in a UFO or the different map. Oh no, you can't. Is it stopping me? Oh no, it isn't. Okay, and there's obviously all the different obelisks at the bottom here. And we can actually fly over to the main bit. What's happening? <laughs> what? Okay, maybe it just starts to spawn in again. Can we fly into it somehow? Is there anything on the top? Oh, what's just happened? We've just lost our UFO and now we're just falling. <laughs> <laughs> that was not meant to happen. But yeah, I really, really, really like the look of this map. I feel like it has so much potential. And we can actually overlook some of the different islands here in the world of Ark. So, let me know what you thought about this video. Did you enjoy it? Did you enjoy exploring Ark, uh, like, in this sort of way? Would you like to see more? Should we go on more different types of adventures? Let me know. I know I like to do news on the channel and stuff, but these types of things, you go on to, you get to explore new things. You don't know what's coming your way. is always very fun. Thank you for watching, guys, and I'll see you in my next video. See you guys later.